gambler pulled up to the house and asked for directions. To my dad? Hell no. This was a real man. Wore a three-piece suit with hard shoes and smelled like a pine forest after a spring rain. That's very poetic, Peggy. What he did to me wasn't poetic. It was filthy. And I loved it. Right, wait, 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 wait. Gotta write it down. Go. Really? Come on. Is there anything on these pages that you do like? Hold on. Nope. <laughs> you know, this is your life you're crapping on. I just wrote it down. You got Mudlick all wrong. The people, the geography. How the heck did I get from the barn dance to the car to consummate my forbidden love with Troy when it was parked up on McGrady Hill? You ran. Okay. Fueled by a burning lust that would soon consume both of them. Now, that is a great line, and I'm not cutting it. <laughs> Why did I spend all that time drawing you a map of Mudlick if you're not going to use it? Really? You want to talk about the map? Let's look at that map. Oh, here we go. Home. Big tree. Crick. <laughs> If you know where two out of three of those are, you can find your way anywhere. It's called triangulationing. This is not a map, Peggy. This is a taunt from a serial killer. You have to go there. What are you talking about? Road trip, Peggy. We're going to Mudlick. I'm not going back to that hellhole. Your name can go first on the title page. Read your contract. I got that months ago. Seriously? Watch your speed. Watch your speed. I am going the limit. What? What is it? Did you not see that sign? You're barreling through a deer crossing. There are no deer. Oh, really? I guess you know more than the Missouri Department of Roads. No, I just... Uh... Okay, I'm going to look out for deer. These woods are full of them. They breed like immigrants. Listen, Peggy, I know that you are reluctant to go back home, but I think it's going to be good for the book and for you. What the hell's wrong with me? Nothing. You're perfect. <laughs> what? what? I think I need to run around. It's been 30 miles. God, you and me both. <laughs> no. God. Who the hell are you? Molly T-Bone. T-Bone Molly. Pleasure. Why is he in her car? He needed a ride. To where? His killing grounds? I was a thumb jockey myself back in the day. All right. 17-year-old mm. girl all alone on the highway. I wasn't worried. People were kind back then. I think they still are. Somebody's hair smells delicious. Okay, here's your stop, t -Bow. nickel tour of Mudlick. <laughs> Gotten used to the smell yet? Well, I, I have to admit, there's a there's a certain funk. Are you sure we didn't step in funk? <laughs> you stepped in Mudlick. There's no scraping that off. <laughs> Bella, Tom, Captain, you are spending too much time with the elderly. <laughs> what? Listen, Peggy, when we're done with the book, you can pitch Will with as many gentlemen callers as you'd like. But right now, we got work to do. What are you talking about? Now I think she got a guy in there. Who is it, Margaret? No judgment, Ma. Have a nice time. <laughs> Rosemary. Mike, this is my sister, Rosemary. Rosemary, your nephew, Mike. All right, good night. <laughs> now, how about that? I finally got to meet my aunt. <laughs> uh, and here's your cousin, Colby. Only one of my six who made it out of Mudlick lives in Plattsville, five miles up the road. I can resist the pull of a big city. Oh, I just can't get over you. You've got that chiseled jaw and strong shoulders, just like your grandma. Really? All my mom ever told me about my shoulders is they almost killed her on the way out. It was like giving birth to a 14-pound biplane. <laughs> I bet you were a roly-poly lump of love. <laughs> I guess, yeah. Peggy, why didn't you tell us that Rosemary was coming for a visit? I just wanted to make sure she and I could both stand to be in the same room together. Let the alphas sniff each other's behinds before we let the rest of the pack in. <laughs> so is everything smelling okay? Well, the few whiffs we've had have been downright pleasant. Oh, yeah. 
Maybe we should start going over some of the stuff we've already written. You know, just make sure it still rings true. So, you think I'm a liar, too? <laughs> no, I don't, but memory is a funny thing. You know, last week, I could have sworn that I pulled that nozzle out of the gas tank before I drove away. And then I get home, and I see 10 feet of hose dangling from my car, and I had to tell myself, I may have remembered wrong. Hey, you may be an idiot, but I'm not a liar. You know, I'm trying to help you here. You make it very hard. I don't need help from anybody. Let's just finish the damn book and be done with it. Fine. This is my story. I know what went on in that house. You lived it. Exactly. Let's just forget about Rosemary and get writing. Right? Rosemary was always the perfect one. <laughs> always said the right thing, got good grades. You know what it's like to grow up in the shadow of a sister like that? <laughs> I kind of am that sister. <laughs> Maybe I was to blame. I never made it easy for people to love me. Daddy said I was born sour. <laughs> I guess he was right. You're not sour. You're tangy. <laughs> Don't sugarcoat it. I'm a big pain in the ass. <laughs> Nobody wants to be around that. stop feeling sorry for myself we got a book to write you know what if it helps i do believe you thanks it doesn't <laughs> there's it Kate and Molly, stay alive i will find you b14 b14 I-19. Piggy says you used to take pictures for magazines. <laughs> I'm not deaf, honey. I am. We got the sister to bless our cards. We got baby Jesus on our side. Oh, this is where he's been hiding out while the rest of the world is going to hell. <laughs> to the owner of the older mustard yellow Impala, your headlights are on. Huh, that's me. I remember turning those on. Look at us, losing it together. I guess we're closer to that Jamaican pillow kiss than we thought. G46. You! Bring your cards to the roll winners! Get in! Oh, Molly, you can't have her yet, Peggy Bins! Yeah, Mom. She did what? Well, now, hold on. Kidnapping's a strong word. What did Molly do exactly? Okay, well, yeah, technically that is kidnapping. Okay, I, I... Okay, okay. Ma, I gotta go. Uh, th things are starting to get ugly down here. No, 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 I, I didn't mean you, ladies. You. Certainly perking up. Shut up.